a vessel that is closed can only contain its capacity, but a vessel that is open can contain infinity. Are you an open vessel? Let's talk about that. But first, please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that bell so that you can be notified when new videos are available. Let's get started. Hi everyone. Welcome to Mana for Thought. Today I want you to think about this. Whatever it is that is holding you back from becoming who you are supposed to be, it is time to take the lid off because a vessel that is closed can only contain the knowledge they're in, but a vessel that is open can contain knowledge that is infinite. So how do we do that? How do we take the lid off? By opening our minds and our hearts and removing the limits that we have placed on our lives. This is what Paul said in 2 Corinthians verse 4. For God who commanded the light to shine out of darkness hath shined in our hearts to give the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Jesus Christ. But we have this treasure in earthen vessels that the excellency of the power may be of God and not of us. We are earthen vessels in our frail, imperfect state. But God wants to give us the knowledge of him. So when we walk according to our own strength and our own power, we walk in a covered vessel. But when we walk in the power and the knowledge of who God is, we walk as an open vessel. But oftentimes, we tend to want to put God in a box. We tend to want to lock him away based on our finite minds and our finite thoughts. But God is bigger than that. He is past finding out. He is past our understanding. He is God. This is what Psalm 145 says. Great is our Lord and of great power. His understanding is infinite. Listen, God is a big God and he wants us to open up ourselves and open up our lives to him so that we can find out what our purposes are. So we can find out what our calling is. I want to encourage you. Let's take the lid off fear. Let's take the lid off uncertainties and remove the lid from the thought of failure. Knowledge is power. But a wise man once told me that knowledge is power, yes. But it is knowledge that is applied that brings great results. So I want to encourage you. Apply the word of God to your life so that you can see great results and remove the lid so that you can find out your purpose. Listen, I want to hear from you. Leave me a comment below. I want to hear how these videos are impacting your life. So let's chat. I'm Alison Cornelius, and thank you for joining me on Mana for Thought.